So what's up guys? long time no see i will update you guys on what's been going on later on in this vlog but we're not gonna harp on the negative we're gonna go straight into the positive happy valentine's day <laughs> baby who is that on facebook i think his name is kerwin, kerwin something. it's a kerwin something kerwin, which one Cur yeah, Curry like Claiborne or something like that. Like he always be doing like the ghetto skits and stuff and he called Valentine's Day Valentine's Day. So now me and baby say it. Even though last year she said it one too many times, I went the fuck off. Cause I get tired of hearing it. So I know I'm gonna do that again. But anyway, you know I wasn't gonna leave y'all out on our Valentine's Day this year. We are going to stay at the Omni, but this time we're going to stay at the one downtown. Baby did good, y'all. Um, so we're going to stay downtown at the Omni and we're we are going to eat at Bob's Steakhouse Chop House. I'm going to bring you guys for dinner and stuff like that. I just got off of work. I actually went to work. But, y'all, I can tell you, for one, this is going to be an amazing Valentine's Day. Because baby took off. Yes, sis! She took off of work. Like, I cannot believe it. Last year, neither one of us took off from work. Um, But, yeah, this year she actually got the night off. She is off on the Thursday. So, we're going to go and turn up and just have a good time. This is our first Valentine's Mary. And, actually, Monday is the 18th. And that will be our six-month wedding anniversary. So, we're just trying to do, like, the whole little celebration in one. Um, But, yeah, I just got home from work. Walked in the house. Baby got the music playing. I had to tell her to turn that off. That's copyright <laughs> but anyway um yeah she in here i packed last night she said she just finished packing and stuff like that so we're about to give her the exchange gifts so we don't have to take that to the hotel i do see that she got me some roses right here i'm over here y'all because in, in this apartment just needs some light i'll be so glad but she got me some red roses and y'all know she get me flowers every sunday um, so I still have the flowers from last Sunday and they still look amazing. So they are just blooming and living their best life. So she just got me more roses and red roses. So I feel like super duper special. So I'm going to go ahead and get these in some water um, so they can bloom like those. We got plenty of vases because from the wedding, I bought 36 of them for centerpieces. And I bought and not rented. So I have them forever. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm just going ahead and get my red roses put up. And then we're going to do the gift exchange. So I'll show you guys that. And then after that, we're going to leave, go to the hotel, check in. And then dinner is not until 930. Yes, y'all. Like we grow. We doing dinner, dinner tonight <laughs> um so yeah we got dinner at 9 30 but it give us enough time to get to the hotel get comfortable me to get ready because i got braids um just so i can have something to do with my hair because y'all Again, I will update y'all later on in the vlog. Um, but I'm going to go, you know, and just do my little glow up or whatever. So, stay tuned to see how our Valentine's Day turn out. All right, guys. So, before we get ready to head out, we're going to go ahead and open up our gifts. Baby, I already gave me my card. I'm a little nervous. Um, It says, to my wife, two or better than one. Oh, Ecclesiastics 4 and 9. She mean like me and her together. Good gracious. Child. <laughs> Oh, she wrote it here. Hold on, I'm just gonna read it. Oh. Oh, yeah. Hmm. That was sweet. You need to say nothing about my little hearts on front of the car. Where? On front of the red part, the red. Oh, car. this little part right here, y'all. Uh -oh. oh, which one? <laughs> oh, she even drew. Do me and my little heart. Boop. Yeah. Oh, it is so nice. This is super nice. Like that, like that, you like that, you like that. I like it. All right, duty. Happy Valentine's Day. All right. This is heavy, y'all. Okay. Um, so we got a little berry. Say hugs. You like my mama. You don't take the price tag off. Shit. <laughs> 
So I got a little bear. I will take it to work, but I hate them right now. <laughs> Oh, wait a minute. Look at all these monies. It's a I lot said, of money. I know. There. You got a family pack? No. Okay, what is this? Is this for you? Yeah, just because I knew I couldn't get the um heart. Oh, yeah, because I had told her yesterday about um some um Kit Kat candy or whatever because I have my cheat days on Sundays. I'm going to turn this Kit Kat up. It's a whole bag of Kit Kat. What is this? Y'all, like, it's literally a whole bag of Kit Kats. <laughs> that girl went crazy. I'm gonna have to put some, give you some. I was gonna I get, get you a candy. You, we don't know that. I know. I was gonna get that big old, um. Wait a minute, what is this? That say? big old ball <gasps> thing. It's saying Nicki Minaj on it. <laughs> Look! It is the perfume, and it's, oh my god. If y'all are OG followers, y'all know, know Nikki is bae. Oh my God. I don't care how it smells. It's Nikki. Look at this big ass I know. bottle. This, this turns into a bracelet. Oh my God. Yeah. It's like a little crown on it'll her. It turns into a bracelet. Yeah, I yeah. love it. And it even got the little Nikki Minaj on here. Yeah, it's it's kind of cool. Oh my God. Oh my God. It better smell good too. I know. Hold on, I can't smell it. I'm gonna have to spray it on me. Mm. Just a little on my hand. Okay. Oh, yes! Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. This smells like all of her perfume was in one. Like, oh my. Oh, I this love thing. it. Oh, no, that's just attached to it. Oh, my Let God. that top part come off, and you can turn it into a necklace. See on the side? Yeah, bracelet. Bracelet, yeah, you see that? Oh, yeah, I see it. Mm -hmm. That is so cool. I know you said you didn't have no perfume. Yeah, I um, was running low on my high end stuff. Oh my God, I love it. And look at this, Box like, case it came in. Yeah, it shocked me too. Oh my God. See, now I said we was going to leave presents here. <laughs> I want to take it to work tonight. Dude, it smells so good. And look at the box, like, oh. It's a I really do like it. Yeah. I really do like it, baby. I'm happy I went with it because I had went with something totally different. I was like, but she wants something to smell good. Oh, and she she collect those, so yes. I got that's the last uh, one. I think it ain't no more. Oh, this is gonna shit on my gift now. We're not comparing. <laughs> We're not. We're not comparing. Okay, time for baby. All right, here's your card. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I got a Hallmark card. <laughs> oh my god, that smells so good. I wanna like bring it. Bring it. So where is today? Oh, they smell so good. <laughs> okay, now for your gift. It's a nice one. It's a hard bag. Oh, I got a box of some lips on it. Put your card up there with my card at. Okay, and here's your gift. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this girl, do this shit. Hey, sorry. You can guess. But you do this to me all the time. I don't know. This is it. This is it. Oh, so this was my gift to her, and pretty much it just says I'm trying to focus it. Oh, oh, is that my eyes not focused? Okay, so pretty much it just says Happy Valentine's Day, and I told her her gift is she can pick any shoes that she want. Um, and look, I just got some logos and stuff. <laughs> Um, but y'all see this heart where it say up to 220 you have to put a, a value on this one Because she'll go in there and try to pick up something that, that costs five six hundred dollars. I ain't got it But um, yes, yeah, so you can pick any shoes that you want up to two hundred and twenty dollar value. That's including tax and Tomorrow guys, we are going to do brunch at breadwinners and baby think that we're going to breadwinners 
on McKinney Ave, but we're actually going to Breadwinners inside North Park Mall. And after we eat, we're gonna go buy whatever shoes you want. Man, this is super cool. My heart is going to ruin. <laughs> I can't believe what she made. Buy me some shoes. <laughs> <laughs> she cheated. <laughs> she cheated. Y'all, she cheated. Yes. Yeah, so that is your Valentine's gift. You better include them taxes in their price. <laughs> All right, guys. So, baby is satisfied. I'm satisfied. I love my perfume. Like, I didn't mean to yell. I love it. It's, I still smell it on me. I'm finna. I'm, I really don't want to put it in my luggage because, no, I'm taking it because I can wear it tomorrow, tomorrow. So, yes, it's coming with me. But anyway, we finna run up out of here so we can go check into the hotel. So, I'll see you guys at the Omni. my wife got me for valentine's day i'm gonna do a quick little room tour i showed y'all a little when i came in like it's lit it's lit babe man they out of it's lit okay so let me show y'all i can't stop smelling all right so here is the front door right here and as soon as you come in you have this little area over here that has a keurig and then everything that you need for the keurig is inside here and then you have an ice bucket water glasses and then down here you have a safe and a refrigerator um so you can keep stuff in so that is super super nice everything in the room is operated by this card if you take it out the lights the air everything goes off so you have to leave that card in Oh, and then baby wants y'all to see the picture of Big Tex. Like, oh yeah, with our train system and everything. Y'all saw the train in the fair video. So if y'all haven't seen that fair vlog, we rode that train. And then right here, uh, skill me, Miss Tucson. Here is the bathroom. So you come in. They got rugs in the hotel, y'all. That is a rug, <laughs> a bath mat. Um, but anyway, this this is the um vanity area. It is super nice. They got all the towels. Oh, oh, and it's like a cabinet. Cool. And then here's the sink. This is the mirror. And there is a TV inside the mirror. I've been trying to turn it on. The remote keep blinking, but it ain't came on. Then it has a makeup mirror, mirror so I can slate his face. Look at this painting. Then here go the toilet. But wait a minute. Check this shower. Oh, my God. It is a nice stand-in shower. And it has the rain head. And this is huge. It has like a little step. 
And what, what, oh, that's how you turn it on. I was like, where'd that come from? Then that's where you hang your robe or your towel. So then coming out the bathroom, come this way. And then there's this really big mirror right here. Disregarding some work clothes. I'm going to slay in a minute, y'all. I'm going to slay in a minute. <laughs> and then over here, this is where the television is. And it has like a mirror thing. I think this opens. Oh, no. I don't want to turn these people stuff off. <laughs> So it doesn't open yet. So baby got the TV on. And then here is a little table right here. They got a waste basket right here. And then right here, there's like another little area where you can like, if you have luggage, you can put that on. And a nice little table and a lamp. Here go to paint another painting. And then check this view. We got the city view. So tonight, this is going to be so lit up. When I tell you this is going to be so nice, y'all. This horse right here lights up and it rotates. And I'll show y'all that a little bit later. And we are in the heart of downtown Dallas so we see everything and subway down there turn up baby say we gonna go down there <laughs> yeah so then over here disregard like all my bags and stuff but yeah this is one of the tables then we got a king size bed look how they did like this is what I want to do in our bedroom baby with the pictures oh like over there that is so nice and then it's the king bed. This is baby stuff. Y'all see baby laying on the little ottoman and couch thing. Yes. Um, they have 24-hour room service. Here go a table. Then they have another little table right there. And then it brings you back to here. So, yes, guys. I'm about to, like, chill out, get my stuff out so I can get ready to get ready. <laughs> um, I'm not doing anything too drastic. But I just want to bring, you know, Mrs. Tucson out tonight. It's Valentine's Day. Baby, what you got to say? Man, happy Valentine's. <laughs> I am really enjoying this. Like when I turn this way, the lighting is kind of so y'all probably not gonna be able to see. But man, when I tell you that view is everything. Like this is the second time that I've stayed in a hotel this year with a view. Thank you, Jesus. See, he, this is how he telling me he about to elevate me. <laughs> but I'm gonna come up off this high horse. I will see you guys once I am glowed up. Okay guys, so actually we got a whole lot of time <laughs> because our reservations are not until 9.30 and it's just now like 6 o'clock. So we're going to go and explore the hotel, see what's downstairs. They have seven different restaurants, a sports bar, a gift shop and stuff like that. So we're going to go down, see what's popping down here and then we're going to come back up and get ready for dinner. So I haven't glowed up yet, but we about to go see what this hotel looking like. <laughs> So we are ready to go. It is 9.15 on the dot. So we're going to get ready and head to dinner. The restaurant is actually in the um, hotel. So we just have to go downstairs. I just decided to do like a simple look. I threw my braids in a cute bun. And since I'm not wearing a necklace, I decided to do like a bigger earring. And then my dress is just like this green velvet dress. And then I'm wearing these like sparkly um, minimalist sandals. Let me show y'all baby. 
Here go my baby, her look good. She dressed up nice. Oh, here she go with this dance again, y'all. <laughs> she just decided we finna eat. So yeah, we finna run down. So they have this like staircase. I think I, I think y'all saw that before this. I gotta go and take a picture there. I have to. So we're gonna go and do that. I did bring me a bag um, to carry with me. It's this like clutch bag. It like matches the, in my shoes and stuff like that. So I'm like, okay, it's just gonna be like a little pop. You know, a little extra with the bag, but I need something to hold like the room key, camera, phone, all that stuff. So, yes, we're gonna go to dinner and I'll show you guys what we eat. back from dinner baby went down to smoke a cigarette y'all know she got to find somewhere to smoke a cigarette and i'm about to get ready to take my makeup off and get ready for bed this bed is amazing the view is amazing the pillows i'm telling you they got to have um feathers in them because it is too good but i'm in the bathroom i have the disney channel on on the mirror let me show y'all So yeah, this is what I'm up here doing. I'm gonna watch TV, take my makeup off, and then, like I said, get ready um, for bed. It is so crazy, like I work today, so I am like really tired, and then we ate. I never, ever eat this late, but you know, special occasions cause for everything. My bum fell, so now it's just one big ponytail. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take my makeup off, and I will see you guys in a Good week. morning, guys, and happy Friday. So we are up in Adam, ready to go. We are now now about to go to this place called breadwinners which is a brunch spot but um monday through friday they do like breakfast lunch and dinner so we're gonna go there and just have brunch and then afterwards we're gonna walk in the mall so baby can get her some shoes i'm going to sephora because riri launched her lipsticks and her concealer and i'm going to pick that up it is what it is baby thank Soon. you for an amazing valentine's day valentine's <laughs> um it was so good like the food was so good y'all like the bread the butter everything was <laughs> so good that stuff i don't get to eat on the regular you know so when i enjoy it or when i get to enjoy it i enjoy it so now we're about to go and i'll show you guys what we get um we're both thinking breakfast we already looked at the menu so we're both thinking breakfast so we're gonna have breakfast items and then we're just gonna shop around so stay tuned to see what today brings us your eyes are beautiful Thank you, my baby. <laughs> Before we go, we're gonna go check out the pool area. It's like the room key. And we're gonna go check out the pool area. So that way we can show you that. Oh, that right there is the Reunion Tower. Hold on, when I get closer, I'll show you more. It's the Reunion Tower and it's a restaurant and a um, hotel as well. Right. That right there. And I forgot how many floors it is. It's chilly out here. They have the towels over here. Oh, the courtyard right there. Yeah, this is super, super. And it's a spa area. We couldn't, yeah, we coulda. Yeah. Okay, guys, so, sorry, I had to clean some memory off. But yeah, this is like a little kitchen area over here. And then this leads to like the front of the hotel. So what we saw from the room, the horse and everything like that. And I was telling y'all, fun fact, that building right there is where I did my intern for high school. It's a bunch of law offices and I worked for a lawyer. Um, so yeah, I did my intern there. And then this is just downtown Dallas. And then this is the like pool area over here. Oh, the WFFAA Tower is there for like Channel 8 News. And then there's like a really nice bridge over there. But me and baby gonna do more on that side of town so y'all can see more of that. Um, but yeah, so this is like super, super, super nice. Um, it is people actually in the pool. It's not like cold, but it's not hot either. Then they have everything out there. So baby. Say hey to the people. So and today you have Koyo sporting her 
her um what's that called hoodie with her little pants and her J's all black all black <laughs> these are our bags because we getting ready to head out yeah uh-huh and me i just have on jeans these shoes because i left my vans and just a black shirt so anywho guys let's go so we can eat because i'm starving the North Park Center. This is our bougie mall because it has Louis, Gucci, Prada. I don't think it's a Chanel in here, but it's all high-end stuff. And of course, I'll get some clips of that. Probably no talking clips because here they really don't want you recording in the stores because they don't want you recording that they had a nice never full sitting on the counter and you know somebody else come and pick it up. <laughs> right. That's what they don't want. <laughs> um, You want to walk around here, baby? I don't know where you're going, baby. Because well, we can go in Macy's so we can know we got to come back out Macy's. So that we'll know where the car is. But yeah, so we're gonna go in the ca um the Breadwinners Cafe place that we're gonna eat is actually inside the mall. I know. So I had to um and see this was a part of baby surprise. My braids look not like it's not working. <laughs> this was a part of baby surprise. Um, because she thought we were going to the one just a regular restaurant. She didn't know we was coming to the mall, but we came to the mall to eat, and then afterwards we're gonna walk those calories off and go get us our stuff. So, yes, guys, let's go in the mall. We're gonna go in through Macy's. All right, guys, so they got Tiffany and Co. Um, Dose and Gabbana is coming in the fall. Over here, they got Rolex. Here's one of the Louis stores. They have another Louis store that we get past. David Yerman. And then um, YSL is coming in the summer. So I'm so excited. <laughs> Look, I'm excited. I like to go in too. <laughs> and then Burberry is right here on the corner. But y'all, let me show y'all what Burberry did. Tory Burch is over there in that corner. I gotta show y'all what Burberry did. Y'all peep Ugg over there. Okay, she said make a left at Burberry. See, here go the other Louis Vuitton store. Oh, okay. Look what Burberry did, y'all. This big purse, what? Okay. This is a champagne and they put the orange juice. You see how much orange juice they put compared to champagne. Oh, so me and baby gonna hold together. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. 
and they put a little strawberry on it. And y'all, this cake, they put this, like, you know when you go to restaurants and they give you bread? Sis, get you some. <laughs> Y'all, brunch is lit. So I got cheese, eggs, cheese, potatoes, chicken, apple sausage, and a biscuit. And baby got the same thing I got, but no cheese. And she got chicken on the side. So we're about to get ready and indulge. Okay, y'all, we at the food court. They have a Chipotle inside the mall now. This one is new. It gotta be, because I don't remember Chipotle being in here. It's over there. But we are looking for Sephora. And then baby gonna go to finish line to see if she can find some shoes. Oh. I see Vision Works, GameStop, Lids, H&M, huh? Yeah. Okay. Um, and we kind of fool. So, but we're gonna try to walk these calories off of the. <laughs> so y'all, we walking trying to find stuff because this mall is huge, and I really don't come here often, so I don't know anything about it. But there's a Zara in here, and next to the Zara is the Sephora, right? <laughs> When I finally realized the Sephora was right there, I took off running. Baby, I'm like, slow down. I'm running out of up in here. I'm clutch your ass, but I'm not running. Oh, and the Morphe store is in here. I forgot they have a Morphe store, and it's like right next to it. Exactly. Yeah, okay. so I'm definitely going in Morphe. Look, I know this is Courtney's shopping trip, but I need to get a little something for me. Hello. So I'm like, I need to go to Sephora. I need to go to Morphe. Zara is right here. Huh? What? You said, hey, she didn't think you were going to say it. Oh. You killed us about she Um. It was somebody looking at me because I'm vlogging in the middle of the mall and there's people in here. Oh, they got the right band. So in the van store, baby. Okay, but oh, and Lush is right here. Sephora and Lush. Okay, y'all, we going in. dollars later but you know what god is good because good <laughs> everything was in stock <laughs> i know baby i always say the when you spend the most money your bags are the smallest yes. remember that um but now we finna come to the we finna do what we need to do y'all see morphe behind me though right i ain't gonna do that i'm gonna say that for a whole nother vlog because baby gotta work tonight and if we go in the morphe store i need to swatch and i need to do a whole lot of stuff so i'm gonna come back and go to the morphe store we have two they have a nick store as well we have two Morphe stores, one one here and then one in the Galleria now. Here is the next store right here and Finish Line is next. So we're gonna go to the Finish Line and hopefully baby find some shoes and then we're gonna go home so she can go to sleep and I can clean up. There go coach baby. nothing in finish line so we're just gonna go to another mall um and just go to Foot Locker they have a foot action because this was finish line and they didn't have anything she did pick up those feelers then she changed her mind to some Air Max then she changed her mind to a woman's pair of Air Max so yeah we gonna go and get her some shoes she buying some shoes today <laughs> So guys, I can't even stunt in front with y'all. Today is Saturday and it is actually 8.39 on Saturday night. I was in the middle of editing this vlog so you guys can see it and I realized one, I didn't show y'all what I bought from Sephora. Two, I did not show y'all what shoes baby ended up picking. And three, I didn't even close out the vlog. So first things first, baby ended up getting some Nike Hirachis. These are the ones that she chose. Um, she looked at Air Max Fila's. 
um, Jordans, everything. And these are the ones she said she always wanted. So, yes, those are the shoes that she ended up getting. Um, and they weren't even that expensive. So, she still got a little money left. So, she said she's either going to find an outfit to go with those or um, just get, like, another pair of shoes or whatever. So, I was like, okay, you know, I gave you a limit. So, you better use it before I do. <laughs> and then from Sephora, I picked up the three of the new launch of Rihanna's lipsticks. And I also picked up the concealer. So I got the concealer in number 400 and I'm using it as an under eye concealer. And I'll show y'all how it looks. And everybody just keeps raving about it and saying it's really, really good. So I'm like, okay, let me try this for myself, which I have all of the foundation, the primer, the highlighter, everything else. So I know this is gonna be amazing. So yeah, this is the color that I got and it pretty much is just going to be like my under eye concealer. It is almost the same color as my MAC Pro Longwear, so it should go well. But of course, the next time I do my makeup, I'm going to try it out and I'll let you guys know. And then for her lipsticks, she got Undefeated, which was the purple color. There was Unattached, which was like an, a coral color. And then unlock, which was like that hot pink color. So I'm super, super excited. I have literally all of her lipstick, well, all of her liquid lipsticks, except for one. It was like the lighter brown color or tan color. I didn't get that one. Um, but I do have her black, her brown, the mauve color. Now I have these. I got the Fenty Balm, the Diamond Milk Balm. Um, I don't have the last one she came out with, the lip gloss. I don't have that one. So yeah, I'm gonna try those out. And um, a couple of my subscribers hit me up and asked me to do beauty videos as far as like maybe showing makeup reviews and stuff like that. So I'm going to try to like throw that into the vlogs because again, I don't want to do like dedicated sit down beauty videos because I'm not a beauty guru. I just, you know, do what works for me. But I can give my opinion, you know, especially for like beginners and stuff, especially when it comes to like this concealer, which I thought this concealer was $18. I don't know why in my mind I thought it was. It ended up being 26 So since this is like a uh, higher end concealer and when it comes to the price um yeah this is something that you know i could get my opinion on to see if you want to go and spend your chuchos because i love riri i know she's gonna do me right and i also do my research out all the time um before buying stuff so that's how i knew i didn't want one of those liquid lipsticks from the last lunch but i'm gonna need her to go sit down somewhere and start making music and stop taking out my money <laughs> and if my energy is low y'all i think i done got sleepy baby left to go to work and I'm just here chilling. Like I said, I was editing the vlog. And I'm like, uh, yeah, I slacked on that part. But, but yes, I really enjoy Valentine's Day. I enjoy the day afterwards. Just spending time with baby and going to the mall and having brunch. Like, we haven't did that in so long. And I just appreciate her for everything that she did for me. And she keeps telling me over and over and over how excited she is for her gift. And it's so crazy because it's like both me and baby are simple people. Like, we like what we like. You know what I'm saying? And that uh, Nicki Minaj that she got me the perfume, it is limited edition and it's only on Nicki's website where you can order it from. Um, and the little part that I showed y'all um, that said it was a bracelet, it really is a bracelet. I wore that to dinner. Um, and I didn't even show y'all in the video, but yes, it really is a bracelet and it fit and it's like so dainty and so cute. So Nicki not only served smell good, she served accessories as well. Like I love Nicki. I don't care what nobody else say. Nicki is is bae, you know what I'm saying? So yes, we really, really enjoyed that. And again, guys, so sorry for my absence, but work is killing me. I told y'all too earlier, I was just to tell y'all, you know, kind of update y'all on what's going on. So pretty much I am doing four jobs at one time. Um, the help desk person ended up leaving, like I told y'all before. And so I took over that position, but that position is a whole position in itself and I still have to do mine. So I still have clinics, curtains, and mats. So I'm still taking care of all of my customers. And if you're a new subscriber, because I do have quite a few new subscribers, um, I am a customer service rep for clinics here in DFW. And it is so crazy because I have, man, last time I think we counted, I mean like, 260. So I have like 260 clinics that I rep for. And then I have over 30 accounts and curtains and mats that I rep for. So think about having all that work and then having to be sitting at the help desk 
every day answering phones from 7 to 3 30 and helping all the rest of the customers in total i think we have 560 accounts or 565 accounts but they're all the rest of the accounts are divvied up between the other reps so yeah just think about me having to work the help desk and deal with all of the help desk issues on top of me still doing all of my clinics the curtains and mats and then i have six employees that i supervise as well so keeping up with them and making sure they're on track and keeping up with attendance and doing payroll like my days are filled like i've gotten to the point where i do not work over eight hours like i'm not gonna work myself crazy i'm not gonna go crazy i do what i can do i have gotten really good at like making daily to-do lists and just keeping up with it like that because y'all i don't even know what day it is sometimes like i am constantly on the move and like i said it's like every time i get ready to just buckle down and be like boom this is what we're gonna do i'm gonna get two videos out a week or three videos out a week it's like something stops me but i'm not gonna let it let it stop me i'm okay. gonna continue to get these videos out to you guys and i really appreciate the love and support that i get because like i said i know i'm not consistent i wish that i could be like i wish i could be consistent um but i do know that better days are coming you know the position is gonna be hired we're gonna hire somebody for the position but we're gonna have to wait till the next fiscal year which is in july so i will be working this to at least july that's the whole crazy part about it so it's like my days are feeling stuff like that but like i said just make sure that you turn your notifications on so you can be notified whenever you know i do post videos or whatever because at this time i can't even give you guys a schedule but only thing i know is every time i'm doing something i'll make sure i vlog so that way we can have videos for you but guys yes work is so crazy and so busy and i'm just trying to stay on top of that and make sure that you know my job is done to the best of my ability because that's my name you know what i'm saying and it's like i like my job i love the flexibility that my jobs offer i even love my customers but it just when it comes to some co-workers i am just not feeling it y'all like i need y'all to send up prayers i am not feeling it it's like have you ever worked with somebody and i'm pretty sure you have but have you ever worked with somebody that like know everything but they never do their job correctly or or follow through and it's just like but i thought you told me you knew this like how many times have can i ask you to do something and you say oh i know this you don't have to tell me i've done this i have such and such years of experience and then you don't do anything right and then now with me being in a help desk position i am the person like the middleman for the plant for every department so i have to deal with transportation i have to deal with production and shipping i have to deal with the customer like i'm the person that everybody go to so it's just like my days are filled and i just thank god for courtney y'all because she really just keep me humble and keep me calm and keep me like grounded because without her like like me and her always talk about like you gotta have a balance in your life and sometimes when work life is hectic then your personal life needs to be on point and for some people vice versa you know and hopefully it's not like hopefully people are not going to work to get away from their relationships because if that's the case see she needs to move around that one ain't for you but you know so you gotta have some type of work life balance or whatever so courtney keeps me grounded she keeps me balanced like i rent to her i vent to her and she just like she's there to offer support and just you know keep it up i've been doing this now for um two months no yeah almost two months um but you know before i covered but when i covered before i was just literally doing um like little jobs and other people was taking over the responsibility but when she left completely i took over the whole position so i do everything for the position and when i say everything i mean not only answer phones but i order all of the scrubs and supplies for the plan i you know keep up with the spreadsheets that we need for billing i do all of that stuff so it's like y'all my days are filled. i know i've said that so many times and it's just like when i get off of work i don't want to do anything like i will work out which i haven't worked out in like two weeks i think it's been yeah i think it's been like two weeks um but yeah i like work out but after i work out i am dead to the world i take a bath and i go get in the bed baby be like it's seven o'clock yes if you come and come out <laughs> that's how it is y'all um i also will be doing a weight loss update for you guys soon i have reached my one year on my weight loss journey i went to the doctor and she was so excited to see how much weight i lost and how good my health is but i will do a full dedicated video to that because i got some questions 
questions that I want to answer. And also, if you have any questions that you want me to answer about my weight loss or anything like that, then leave them in the comments below and I'll grab those questions for that video. Um, but yeah, I'll be doing that and then I'll be going over some stuff. Um, your girl has been on her shit because it's been a, a year now. So I'm just looking at like different recipes and trying new stuff. And I've tried some new stuff that I want to share with you guys. Like Aldi is getting to be my best friend. Like for real for real so i want to share some stuff with you guys so i will do a couple of weight loss videos coming up for you too and also i am partnered with teamy t like i talk about that all the time i have a discount code in the description box below that you can go over and use that everybody asks me all the time crystal what tea do you use you know skinny tea detox tea or whatever and teamy like i use a lot of detox teas um but teamy is the one that i use all the time and my favorite is the teamy colon like y'all hear me talk about that all the time if you do follow me on social media you know i will post a video i love to have that after i've had a cheat day or something like that and as y'all saw baby i was turned up on thursday and friday so i definitely hit my teamy tea today and you skip a day and then you do it again so i'll be drinking it again on monday and that teamy colon tea is the business when i tell you it cleans your colon it's a colon cleanser it's not an uncomfortable feeling it's not like a run to the bathroom oh i'm gonna use the restroom with myself type of feeling um like once the tea i mean once you drink the tea you, it works probably in about i'll say give it about three to five hours between three and five hours is when i start experiencing like okay i gotta go use the restroom type of stuff like that but again it's not like running to the restroom doing anything like that like it's a real good gentle tea but it will clean you out so that's why i love using it after a cheat day because one thing i had to learn and i'll talk more about this in my weight loss update is that like you can't be afraid to treat yourself you can't be afraid to eat those different types of foods because when you eat that for one day maybe even two days that won't affect you know your weight loss or your journey or whatever um and it's just you get back on track so after i have my cheat days i make sure that i jump right back on track and that teamy colon is what really helps me because it goes in and clean out all that you know bad food that i ate and um yeah so anyway i do have a discount code for that down below you can get the teamy skinny which i do have the teamy skinny tea and i do drink it but no lie i drink the colon i go through more of the teamy colon teas than i do anything um and then now they have a teamy face Face mask, I mean detox face mask, and it's also sold at Ulta as well. And they have like a focus tea and some uh, like a sweet tea for like if you want if you need like if you have a sweet tooth and you want tea they have so much stuff so the website and everything is down below my discount code is too because i think i have one for 10 percent off and i think i have one for 25 percent off so yes all that is in the description box you can go over and check it out i love the teamy colon tea i'm just telling y'all that and not because it was sent to me because yes they did send it to me but these opinions of my are my own like i have purchased the tea without them sending it to me and then after that they were like okay crystal you know we'll send it to you so it just i love the um the colon tea like th that's the bees i'm telling you if you just want to get yourself cleaned out that is what you need so anyway i hope you guys enjoy spending valentine's day with us like the omni was everything me and baby did stay at the omni not last year but the year before that but we stayed at the one that's in farmer's branch so it was more in like a neighborhood area so it wasn't like a view and stuff like that but the room was still nice they had a really nice turn down service and all that stuff and the omni dallas is as y'all saw in the heart of downtown and they don't necessarily do like the whole turn down service part because it's like they're like the main omni um so yeah they just you want to go there for their name alone like they don't need i guess all the gimmicky parts of it but i love that there were seven different restaurants the sports bar the gift shop um they had the pool area like it was super nice i loved it that tv in that mirror like y'all i missed it i couldn't even sleep last night thinking about how i'm gonna get a tv and i mirror here in the bathroom i i was just like i was just living my best life and i appreciate baby for everything that she did because she did not have to do any of that but 
um, one thing that we did do, we decided that this year to, you know, keep spice in our relationship, in our marriage, we were going to alternate date nights. So January was my date night month. Um, one man. day after month that I choose a date night or that baby to choose a date night and like, whatever day night she chooses she pays for everything you know she kind of plans everything and i do the same so january was my month and we actually went to epic waters water park i didn't vlog it because of course it's a water park so i wasn't going to take my camera in there and it's an indoor water park because we went to a water park in january but i did do an insta story on that and it was so much fun like it was so much fun i really enjoyed it um and then february was baby's month so um she was like oh yeah i got february so i can just you know do it up for valentine's day so she really really did that march is my month and i still haven't decided what i'll do but i am definitely going to vlog whatever i do for march and then baby has april and that's how we alternate so on so on so yes we're just trying to keep our relationship you know fresh and just keep interesting stuff coming in because if, you know if you're constantly having fun and doing stuff then you know that's how you grow that's how you learn stuff you know that's how you get closer because me and baby have gotten so much closer since we got married like i feel it we talk about all the time like damn how we so so close and it was so funny because when we first met she was so so shy the girl was super shy she wouldn't even talk to me <laughs> so to be married and for her not to shut up at this point i'm just like okay it's turn <laughs> But anyway, guys, again, thank y'all for all the love and support. Thank y'all for rocking with us. Thank you just for all the comments that I get on my social media. Y'all checking on me, hitting me up, liking my pictures, you know, asking me questions. Just all of it. I love it, and I'm going to continue to get you guys some videos out. Like I said, work is driving me a little bit crazy right now. But I have these moments, you know, doing this because I remember the last time I... I remember the last time I was going through this, it was like the end of 2017 where I was just like, I am over this shit. I am ready to find me another job. And then it's like stuff got better for a whole year. Like the whole 2018 was so cool to me. Um, It's just like right now they're getting on my nerves. But it is what it is. I'm going to just let them do what they do. And I'm just continue to do my job and make sure I'm doing it right. So, yes, y'all know I will continue talking, so I'm going to go ahead and cut this vlog off here. Thank, Thank you again for watching, and give it a thumbs up if you like this video. And also, if you are not, this is your time to go ahead and subscribe and turn your notification bell on to be notified when we post our next vlog, which will be coming very, very soon because Mardi Gras is coming, and we booked. <laughs> and I'll see you guys soon.